Like other widgets, you're going to head to Appearance, Widgets, and you're going to find the Summarize Post widget and drag that into an active widget area. If you have any questions, you can click this link here for the appropriate page in the wiki. And what we're going to do here is we want to use this widget to list a series of posts. So first we're defining a search. And for this example, I'm just going to list some custom posts that I've created that are movies. But you can see that there are other uh, search criteria you, you can define here. I'm going to save my criteria. And by default, this will kick out a, an unordered list. And you can see that it's going to limit it to five, and it's ordering it by the post ID. When I save this, we should be able to head over to the front part of our site, the public facing part of our site, and refresh it. And you can see that, yes, it is listing those movies. Um, if you're unsure as to which placeholders might be available, you can use the help placeholder. I'll save and then this should demonstrate which placeholders are available. Most of these are built in columns from the WordPress database but also you're going to have placeholders for any custom fields like this has poster image or related films. So I'm going to put back what I had there. And to show you an example, I'm going to put in a poster image. And just to, so you can see what this looks like. Um, when I refresh this, you'll see that it's listing numbers here. Now, why is it doing that? Because all that's stored in an image or a, a relation field are the IDs of the related posts or images in this case. So we need to do something with that. So we need to use output filters to convert those images to something useful. So I'm going to use the to image tag output filter. And you'll see that this will convert those ima any images that are attached to that particular movie to the actual image. Okay. Hopefully that's a good demonstration for you how you might use this particular widget.